while it is my pleasure to show you the new Palm Tree. The Palm Tree will help you live your life more effectively. It keeps you a little bit ahead of the game. It's so much in sync with you that sometimes it feels like it's thinking ahead for you. Now this is what it looks like on the big screen. It's beautiful. The design was inspired by nature. Our industrial design team and mechanical engineering teams did a phenomenal job. I think it's just beautiful. Now let's talk about some technology. So everyone get their propeller beanies spinning a little bit. We'll talk about what's inside. We wanted you to have a lot of data bandwidth. So we built in the EPDO, Rev A, and 802.11 B and G Wi-Fi. And we didn't want you to get lost. So we built in GPS with third-party turn-by-turn navigation. And we wanted you to use the latest cool accessories. So we built in Bluetooth, version 2.1 with EDR and stereo support. You know, I got some of those nice new Bluetooth stereo speakers sitting on my desk. They sound great. And because you'll be putting a lot of information, a lot of data on the device, we built in eight gigabytes of storage. And because you'll need to be processing all of that information, we built in a really fast processor. We're using TI's latest OMAP 3430 processor. Pre is the first smartphone with this processor. <coughs> and it combines laptop-like performance with a mobile power footprint. Now let's take a look at some details. Let's take a look at the front. It has a gorgeous 3.1 inch display, half VGA resolution, that's 320 by 480. And it's got a touch screen with multi-touch capability. Now the touch screen goes over the display area, but also extends down to the center button. And that area below the, the, below the display is called the gesture area. And we're going to tell you a lot more about that in a little while. Pre also has a variety of sensors, so it knows about the environment that it's in. Now let's flip around the side. You have volume up, down. We flip around the back. We give you a three megapixel camera with LED flash and extended depth of field capability. We have some awesome DSP software that allows you to take phenomenal photographs. And there's a speaker, so you can do a speakerphone or listen to some music. And by popular demand, we've allowed you to remove the back and replace the battery. <laughs> Let's flip around the other side. Micro USB connector for charging. And we give you high speed USB 2.0 with USB mass storage support. So it looks just like a USB drive. Flipping around the top, industry standard 3.5 millimeter headset jack. So you can use those beautiful palm headsets or whatever your favorite are. Mine are like those Bose noise canceling ones, in particular. We have the traditional palm ringer on off switch and a power button. Tap it once, pre goes to sleep. Hold it down, and you get a choice of airplane mode with the radios off, or completely power down the device. Now, it's great to use touchscreen devices. way, there's many, many things you can do with it just like this. But sometimes, you want to jam out an email or instant message. And you know, one of those cheesy virtual keyboards just won't cut it. So we gave you a great slide-out QWERTY keyboard. Okay, let's flip it around the side. You see it's got a beautiful ergonomic curve. It fits great in your hand or against your face. And it works as a phone, either open or closed. Now let's compare the size to some of our, the more uh, popular smartphones out there today. You see that the engineering team did a phenomenal job squeezing all of that technology in a really compact enclosure. Weighs 4.8 ounces. Fits easily in your pocket, and it's a blast to use, single-handed, or if you want to jam out emails with both hands. Now, we'd like to show you how it works, and to do that,